So this is a very important question. I, I see many patients in clinic who also report having anxiety, stress, um, depression, for example. And to my impression, very often the visual snow symptoms, they start prior to anxiety and depression and stress. So imagine you suddenly see something like the visual snow syndrome and you don't get any explanation from the doctors. They tell you probably you're just stressed or you're imagining your symptoms. It's psychogenic somewhere happening in your, in your mind. That's already stressful. And uh, then probably, probably hearing that there's uh, currently nothing that can be done about it that's also really uh, stressful and you always see things moving in your eyes uh, you're not, not able to, to, uh, to accommodate and to, to relax uh, with closing your eyes I think this is a real stress for the patients and for me stress and anxiety are more a consequence of the condition than, 